Eric Gerard from my Facebook community asked a question on how he should measure his daughter running from home to first. He wants to be able to establish a benchmark for her every single time she runs from home to first, and he wants to be able to use a stopwatch versus using a laser. That is a great question, Eric, so let's get right into it. So the correct way that we should be measuring running from home to first is from contact to contact. So when I say that, that's contact when we put the ball in play, that's when we wanna start the watch, and then when we make contact with first base, that's when we wanna stop the watch. This will be a great way to compare your time, time after time. So making sure you always start the clock at contact, stop the clock once you hit the bag. So being able to use a stopwatch can be just as efficient as using lasers. Yes, I know lasers are going to give you a more accurate, precise timing, but when we're just at home training on our own, a stopwatch, our Apple watch, iPhones, now we have them on our, our iPhones or our cell phones, so those can be just as effective, but just making sure that you are measuring the same start stop time every single time. With using this technique with the stopwatch, what is your fastest time? I want to know. My fastest time was around a 2627. So I want to know what your time is. Let me know. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure you go like this video, comment so I know which video you want to see next. Subscribe so that you can see the next video. I'm Natasha Watley with this Tasha tip, and I will see you next time.